Welcome back to this dude's garden. I can't remember if this dialogue is the same. Okay, so you just give me another C, that's cool. But I don't think I'll be cutting those down yet. This is the one I grew, isn't it? Alright, so you, now we just have another seed we can plant somewhere. Like, right here. <laughs> Why not? Make this garden really bustling. how to get back to our little friend. Otherwise, we basically aren't going anywhere. Hang on, I gotta see if any more things grew. Yeah, theoretically, you just go through load zone and skip the growing process. We do actually have another one, okay. That one just connects stairs. How does that work out? Well, I ruined that, but whatever. Oh, hello. Oh, hello. Um, Garner sort of accidentally fed this critter, and now it thinks Garner is its best friend. Maybe it was just hungry before? Garner calls them pom-poms. They aren't carnivores, but an empty stomach would make anyone cranky. Mm, yeah. I'm going to see if I can feed some other critters. Some of them might be a challenge. Okay, but who knows what will happen when they get a full stomach. Okay, well, that's a new mechanic. Uh, Alright, this is actually a new place, so let's just check it out. So we can feed critters. Oh, if I only had my little friend again. Uh, let's, but, but, okay. So what if I do that? Aha, you got it. <laughs> Munchies. Cool. Are you showing me something special, or are you just, uh, you're just docile now? Alright, nothing is really happening, so... Where are we, actually? Tricky to pull off. I'm not really sure how you're supposed to do that. I'll tell you how we gotta get our little friend back. Where are we? That's cool. Oh, nice! We can do a little uh, dash jump. This one. Oh yeah, you're the uh, the bloody seed. Yeah, sure. Take it out. Yeah, you can run around. Oh, 
will be the day when I'll experience some kind of delay. Brummels before. It's a fascinating plant, my friend. Really difficult to get through without tools, so they're useful to keep out intruders, I mean, y'all. Not that Garner's hiding anything in here, no, no, I'm just saying. Ouch. Well, yeah, I shouldn't freaking touch it. Well, I need the ability to touch it. There you are. Well, I can't really deal with you. I guess so. I might get some coffee creamer today. Okay. Plus, plus buns. I might come back, come back there too. You want uh, five and some singles, or want a twenty? How about five and some singles? That should be enough. Let's go down here. Okay, that's how you get to the guy. That's perfect. Going the right way. You don't do anything yet. A while back, Ghana overheard some pilgrims talk about a special chamber, the humidity crib of Ultros. Is that it? It's mesmerizing. Yay. A complete of undesired mental activities. Warning, Gelt shares me to swords at maximum capacity. Oh dear. Love you. You too. Following this path might take us to that one, so let's just let's just go do that. Because uh, the more MacGuffins we get, the more abilities we get. That's how Metroidvania works. Under the bloody zone, it looks like. Boss's legacy. Not a smidge.
Warrior, up here. Oh, it's you. I must admit that your moves carry potential, but you execute them with the grace of a ruffian. You are right. That blade you carry. Where did you... Never mind. Come, let us see if we can hone those skills of yours. Great, we gotta fight you, and you look really strong. I'm not gonna like this. <laughs> You're gonna be the boss of this area. Okay, now it's all the way back there. Uh, are there any others in this little zone? I don't really... We just gotta follow the arrows, actually. Okay, there's one that's way... Oh my crud! This is a huge map! I guess I'm not really sure what I was expecting, but still. Ouch, jeez. Okay, let me just... Alright, fine, I'll just... I'll just collect you as well. Is it marking like those purple things on the map? Those little plants? What are those for? I don't really know how you... How are you supposed to interact with those? Yeah, we are actually in this area, but we are, like, down there. Now we're up here, where we saw the lady. Like, we saw her directly above this spot. Like, that little tunnel that we traveled through. That's clever. <laughs> clever dungeon layout. Boss's Legacy. Alright, now we're finally officially getting the, uh, the main title. <laughs> the, the area title. <laughs> That's pretty cool, though. And you're a new plant. Actually, you're the same plant we found before. You're the one that makes prawn plants. I no, you're. I don't think you are actually. I think you're actually the bloody plant. Are we gonna fight you now? Seems like a good room for it. Let us begin our practice with positioning. Positioning is everything in a fight. Some foes may have weak spots on their backs. Yeah, that's right. Find an opening and slide behind me to strike. Okay. I mean, yeah, this is stuff I already knew. Good form. Again! Yeah, this is like the first thing the game taught me. Not bad at all. Let us move onward. I feel like we should have had this tutorial before. So you're just training me, but I'm sure we will have a proper fight. <laughs> yeah, here's my save point for it. Better uh, get some level ups, I guess. Where's the, the combo thing? Because I know I, I didn't save the combo thing. Ground pound. All right, so that's our ground pound mechanic. Well, I think I will collect this one because this is a move we do tend to use a lot. I guess I should get this one, because faster healing is always helpful. You never know how bad it's going to get later. Of course, we won't even be able to save this until we get uh, one of those things. Actually, what's this one down here? Oops. I mean, we never really need... Never really had a chance to do that yet, but I got this all taken anyway. This sounds helpful. This sounds immensely helpful. I think I was actually gonna target this one, I completely forgot. That's what you, that's what happens when you go days without playing. Perfect. Okay, there's the combo, okay. Yeah, that's what I wanted with our new attack power. Uh, yeah, go for that one since it's available. I would like this one back. 
because this has been helpful for boss fights, but I don't think we can get it back right now. Alright, I think that's good for now. To we'll try to save some of our food for um, a hard battle that might be coming up. Oh, speaking of which! Okay. Okay, we cannot roll under you. Makes sense. You are quite big. Oh. I don't even have that stupid thing. I don't know what I'm thinking here. Ah, you are a jerk. And you fall down. That is interesting. Well, good thing the save point was just right there. <laughs> Not a grave loss. Alright. This doesn't really seem that hard. Uh, okay, you're gonna open with that. I do not know why I'm trying to do that. That's not gonna work. Uh, that is not fair, though. This is not a good start right now. Can you just stop that, please? Okay, that one, okay, that charge didn't even go off. I guess you kind of have to go near that thing before it'll really explode. Alright, that's good for the follow-up attack. And then I can do that. Yeah, this guy's not hard. Yeah, that wasn't hard at all. Yeah, it was kind of a sloppy execution, but it wasn't really that hard. Nothing really special in here, unfortunately. Oh wait, there's actually a path up there. It's only we had a an extra jump or something. Okay. Oh, whatever. I guess I'll save that victory. Let's go down. Oh wait, we can't go down. We gotta get through those gears somehow. We... Yes. Yes, we do, actually. Probably should have planted a platform seed there, but we don't actually have one. Hang on. Okay. I didn't actually mean to hit that other enemy, but whatever. Oh yeah, you got freaking guard. Oh, wow. Actually taking a beating here, we should probably eat something. Yeah, that restores a lot of health actually. That's something. Whoa! Yeah, it's an enemy. What the heck? No 
surprise thing, but that was terrible. Some creatures have a strong guard that is hard to break. Use a heavy attack to cut through that guard. Well, yeah, the game already gave me this tutorial. I don't know why we're doing this. Good form. Again! Your skills are improving, but you still lack a hunter's grace. Like, we literally had to do that for that big enemy we just killed. Okay, this... I don't know. It's hard to say where this is leading me toward, but that's the beauty of a Metroidvania. So now we have to test it against you. Perfect. See? Perfect variety. I got Hunter's Grace. I feel like this gear ability is the next power-up we're gonna get, because there seems to be a lot of these right now. Oh, and that's the, uh, the same enemy again. Oh, no, 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 no. I see what I could have done there. I, that, I saw the prompt for the, the sneak attack. We might as well use this for the first time ever. Okay, okay, bad, 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 bad. Yeah, I forgot about how this works. Oh, okay, you can not actually reach me there. Ow. Well, this time I actually got your good ingredients. Yeah, it might just lead us up there. You can just never predict how the map layout is going to look sometimes. Well, that's the magic of it. Um... I think that might be our only seed type right now. And, and then there's another one, okay. I should eat something, actually. Like a river heart. We've been growing a lot of these. I think we're gonna get another one. Ugh, I can never get that out in time. I should just work on dodging that. Oh, that was stupid. I should have got closer to you. Why can't I do the follow up attack? We have any more seeds? No. I saw another spot up there. Some seeds up here. All right, there's a seed. And here's a secret. <laughs> there's a plant here. Why not? Attack faster than I, I expected. Oh, well, can't go up there yet. I think I'm just gonna eat these bloody pulps, get them out of my inventory. Plus, they do give me some EXP. And we're... This is just the central room of the dungeon. <laughs> I think we're just gonna head this way just to get the uh, the ability that's coming up. I think we're obviously we're gonna need it. I really hope this game has a fast travel. It doesn't... Like, we've gone a long time without a fast travel. And I really hope we get one, because it seems like a pretty huge map. We can't even... Okay, we can go this way, so let's go this way. I need to jellyfish again. Oh, 
Wow, this is quite, uh, what is all that stuff? This is quite the room. <laughs> Let's just immediately plant this. Whoa, you idiot! Alright, well that, that just, uh, led us in a big old circle, didn't it? Yeah, I can't really, uh, do anything about that now. I guess we'll just have to keep going up this way. It didn't seem like that went anywhere in the end. You know, regarding those gears, I wonder if we'll, we'll get the ability to gooify and be able, or, you know, liquefy and be able to squeeze through them. Because I actually did something similar in my Operation Cosmic Story, where I had a kid who can, you know, gooify and he had to go through some gears. I like how this red stuff just uh, covers the whole platform. Come on, this would be a good way to apply our freaking th good. That's what I thought. I just like this setup here. This is really, uh, really cool. How it just goes around the platform and it makes its little sprinklers on the sides here. This is genuinely like a good farming game. Especially since it's got adventure and dungeon exploration on top of it. <laughs> uh, where are we? Yeah, it didn't really seem like we can get over there. Unless it had, like, those orange... No, I'm sure I would have seen those. Let's just keep going this way. I was thinking like had those mushrooms. I really didn't see those mushrooms. Oh, I get it. When I when I stand on these hills, it pushes them down, and that creates a shortcut. I I just noticed that. So now we can get up here from there. We don't have to. Like, keep looping around. That is such good design. <laughs> I really like this area, just because of that, uh, central room. It's like, you know those Zelda dungeons that have a big central room that inter interconnects with the dungeon? Oh, no, I, I thought that was a plant, but, sorry. Not a big deal. There's more XP for me. Uh, you're the lady again. And then, like, you can find ways to make shortcuts within the central area, you know? As a final practice, we'll focus on your versatility and humility as a hunter. Humbling your prey will cause undue trauma, making the spoils less valuable as you push them up. Use varied attacks to keep your mind as sharp as your blade, for this will produce the finest rewards. I know that. Or pretend that I am your prey. See if you can attack me without repeating the same move twice. Okay. Oops. A shrink blade afflicted undue trauma. There are real Dian hunters that treat each wound we inflict as a bond with our prey. Really repeating the same attack, basically without respect for that bond. Not only does it offend the hunting codes. So, this is this gourmet hunter stuff! I like this! But the undue trauma will also ruin the spoils. Give me a moment. 
There. My real my mind is clear. No trauma can start me. Let us go again. <laughs> uh, I mean, I'd like to walk behind you. Okay, uh, okay, you're just saying the same bullcrap, okay. Uh, okay, well, I, I used the same move I see what I did there. Did I use a downward strike? Okay. Okay, that, that was the same move I felt it. Okay, this is tricky. Okay, how much do you want me to do, lady? How much do you want me to do? I can't even roll behind you. Upward strike, uh, yeah, I already used that, okay. Mid-air strike, upward strike, normal strike, ground strike. What other moves do I have? Let's try that one. Okay, so that's a dodge little strike. Okay. Like a duck dodge strike. Okay, so that's what you had to do there. That was tricky. Yeah, I do not think I will do that in normal fighting. I think I'll just stick to my base strategy just to get them over with faster. That's, that's quite a lot of moves to memorize. Frankly, frankly this move is just a new one I just learned. Let's go down here. I think that'll loop, loop around to that old dead end room. Perfect. Oh, it's, it's some lore. Even better. Oh, can we get over there, please? Can we get over to one of those items? From lands golden and blue, I wore my pride like silver, always excelling, never enough. Vibrating columns of air from generations passed down, celebrating the oath of the hunt. Virtuously striving, spiritually withering, I slowed my true metal only through salt and blood. Great, can we get over there? Hmm. Ah, yeah, that's where I made that, uh, that one plant, I think. I feel like that definitely should have been a platform plant. Eh, shame that. You know, I forgot my charge attack. I should have did a charge attack against her. Okay. So that's what this green moss means on the map. It's, it's this, uh, these spiky junk we can't go through yet. So that's two potential abilities in our future, going through gears and going through that spiky junk. Just like we can go through the dark junk. So far our ability, like some, a lot of our abilities so far are just going through kinds of junk. That is actually tricky to get your thing, isn't it? Better eat, eat some stuff. I do like how we can get level ups in the, uh, the thingy, you know, without being at a save point.
I use your scent, making you seem less of a threat to enemies. Oh, that might be handy to have. Oh, I did. Oh, I inflicted poison. All right, that's actually really cool. I'll get battles over with faster. I'm guessing we won't be able to fully go through this stuff. Yeah, I do not think so. Well, it's good to have that have that area on the map when we get the power up. And we know that's the place we can go to. Oh, I did not think you were there. Alright, that was flawless. At least I think it was. I don't have any seeds. We'll just take the lower route first. Yay, I was right, save point. Oh, but uh, going up there is some lore, so let's just go get that now. So not a big deal. I feel like getting a lot of these powers isn't gonna matter if we're gonna lose it all, and we haven't found any of those things yet. Or I'll try to rid me of my vigor and left me beaten, broken, and blood soaked. I was nurtured back to health and strengthened through the care of a friend. She is the most capable blacksmith in northern Erild. Still blind, my pride turned to self pity. And now we'll open another shortcut. Great design. Yeah, slowly but surely we're gonna get to the MacGuffin over there. It just sends us to keep looping through this central room. No reason not have you there. Oh, that breaks those gears! Okay. So, these plants can break those gears. Maybe that's what I meant to do for all of them. And not to mention this little squirter acts as a platform. So that's... Maybe that's like... Maybe there's not really an ability for that. You're just gonna... You just need to put those plants to break them. That's actually really clever. I feel like I haven't been doing it strategically. Well done, Apprentice. You have displayed honor towards both the hunt and your own potential. Now we'll fight seriously, right? Potential, however, is worth nothing without action. So let us see if you act like a hunter, or like prey! Oh, you're throwing off your robe! Huntress Vasa! Alright, true test of our skills. Alright, well we poisoned you. Oh, okay, I can see that poison lasts. Wow, that was just broken. Okay, well that was just sloppy in every aspect. Okay. Okay, I don't know why it stopped me there. Alright, I am not uh, being a good apprentice right now. Oh boy! Okay, instead of trying to do my charge attacks, I should just read your movements and frickin' dodge, you're stupid. Yeah, come on, I should have got you there, what the heck. Alright, this is terrible in every aspect. Okay. 
It seems I underestimated your resolve, Huntress. It seems I overestimated you, because this felt really easy. A costly lesson at the teacher's expense. Setting a trap for others. Okay, well... I am shocked how weak you were, I'm not gonna lie. Though there might be, like, a stronger version of you later, kind of like how there's a stronger version of Hornet. And she was... Hornet was kind of our mentor character in Hollow Knight. Um... Oh, and now we're at, just at the MacGuffin, so you're the... You're, you're the boss. Great. That was so easy! <laughs> This is a fun area. I really like that central room. So I wonder what power-up we're getting now. We got Tremor Modification! It sounds like it's gonna break those spiky things! Alright, so that, that's our next power-up. Okay, now we're just gonna test out here. That's pretty awesome. Um, yeah, that's just gonna loop us back around over there. Is that just gonna be where we deliver the... deliver the robot? I thought we had to, like, go back to the central room first, where the boss is go the final boss is going to be, obviously. Let me go up there first, please. Do we have any seeds? I don't think we do. Um. You're still alive. That blade you carry. He said the sarcophagus was suspended or stuck in a recurring cycle, but that he could fix it. He asked for my help, but I had told him no. The snare, this endless trap, I told him I needed for it to remain. I needed to learn, to understand. I needed to hunt. As I stood in the atrium of the demon, I felt its influence knocking at my temples. It brought me back to the cold mire, steep within the forests of home. Forgive me, secret. I... Okay, now she's dead. Maybe she'll come back in the next cycle. <laughs> because that thing was just marking the boss room. Alright. Yeah, well... Instead of delivering you back right now, I would like to explore these, um... I'd like to explore over there, where all this plant stuff is, because why not? I'd like to do it while we still have all my powers. Not really indicating any MacGuffins that way, but there might be some helpful items, definitely. Like those things that let us save our abilities. Yeah, we're just not gonna level anything up right now, because uh, the cycle might have to end soon. you were destroyed. What? Dang it. Come on, get over here. Yeah, that's exactly what I was hoping for. Keep my phone handy for when she shows up. Alright, uh... Which power would I like to save? I really like the poison. 
I feel like the poison really helped in that fight. And yeah, that's pretty much all I can do there right now. What? So they grow back. Okay, they grow back. Uh, fair enough, I guess. Wait, can it cut those? Is that what this is for? Uh, not really, okay. Uh, yeah, I guess we're just heading down there next. I'm kind of glad, like, this area was just a dead end. There's less to worry about. aren't seeds, are they? Like, for those kinds of plants? No, you're, you know, you're just full of okay. Oh, like, why would you want to grow those kinds of plants? It's, uh, they're just hazardous plants. Even if we had the power to cut them now, it's just inconvenient. Hello. There's a lot of stuff in here. Interesting. Review some lore. That's a good thing we came down here. Driven by love and devotion, she passed the Alwind Raw threshold to defy legends and poison bloodlines. Deep in the ghost mire, she fetched the gnarled roots nurtured by the souls of the lost and drowned. As my self pity turned to iron, the wraith like smoke from the crooked, crooked roots filled the forge, embracing her lungs and loving heart. So romantic. Yep, I could tell you were a secret. Nothing seems to be up there. Oh, hello! Seed Haven. Oh, this is such a good room. <laughs> now, what am I going to put you on? My attack power, obviously. <laughs> no questions there. Ah, and that's how we get back up here. I mean, why would I want to open that? What benefit is there to being able to... Okay, we had to, like, go all the way around. Okay, I can see how this will be helpful. So... I mean, would it work from down here? It's like, theoretically... Like, if I put this seed here... Wait, which one is this? I don't even have the right kind of... I don't even have the blood seed for it. Oh, let's put this one here. Yeah, perfect variety, that time for sure. Oh, yeah, okay, that was the right seed, especially. Oh, I am so good at this. So that just opens a really good shortcut. Uh, for whatever reason, I have to come down here again. It gives me a save point, that's for sure. Yeah, not really gonna try to level anything up till I have another one of those plants, one of those items. Um, yeah, I'll just put you here, why not? Okay, so that isn't- so, like, going through load zones doesn't skip the growing process. Uh, fair enough. I guess I guess it is fun to watch. Can I get any rewards though? Oh, that is disappointing. I don't even get any rewards from it. Maybe it's because I didn't. Like maybe in certain areas you need to plant the correct type of plant. What? Light detected. Only in slight hands are worthy. And oh. So that's what, so is that what those doors mean? You have to make your way there without getting the sword. 
Ugh, that is kind of demanding. Well, at least we have this little shortcut here now. You know, that is genuinely kind of demanding. I don't know if I'll do that. Granted, it doesn't seem like the enemies attack you, or at least that one type of enemy won't attack you if you don't have the sword. Um, I guess we'll try to make our way over there. I don't actually think we can get up there. But, but, uh, it does seem like we're running out of things to do, so we might as well end the cycle. To be fair, I thought that was decent for me. I'm sure you can get killed by that thing. <laughs> I felt like I tried to go up there, but I couldn't make the jump. I mean, we might get an ability later that helps us uh, jump higher. Or even climb walls or something. Because our wall jump doesn't really seem to be that useful. Certainly not as it is in other Metroid Manias. We, yeah, this just takes us back here. Yeah. So that's just gonna take us right back to that room. Fair enough. Alright, this is an easy cycle. <laughs> Very easy area. Oh, the killer hiding behind the facade. Clad as yet another fricative pilgrim. You thought killing more Samusol would make you strong, grant more solace, or perhaps freedom? The seal will remain sufficiently intact as long as at least one Samusol is left alive. Kind of like uh, the Black Egg from Hollow Knight. I shall now fulfill my preordination and deliver Ultras. You are not wanted here! cycle begins anew. Let our quiet mycelium limit the unrest to return to what once was. 